scams threaded by Nigerian troops in Anambra belong to criminals, not our militant army. Yes, I pop. Hello, great viewers. Welcome to my channel. Now, according to the news of the day, the indigenous people of Biafra, I pop, has said that the camps in Oroma and Umewelum Anna in the Anambra West local government area of Anambra State, raided by troops of Nigerian army belong to criminals and not to his militant wings. He stands within the talk here, According to the news, our reporter on Monday reported that the Nigerian army said that it is troops 302 regiment operating under 82 division in conjunction with the Anambra State Vigilante Group in Sunday. Red Dead and Destroy Counts allegedly belonging to fighters of the Apple VSN in Oromo and Omewulum Anan in the Anambra West local government area of the state. The Director Army Public Relations Brigadier General Oyama Wachuku, who disclosed this in a statement, said that during the raid, the troops arrested eight brigands and recovered one AK 47 rifle. One AKMS rifle, three Lexus SUVs, and two motorcycles. He noted that in a separate operation, troops also raided an alleged IPOP camp at Amiatana in the Nambrasa local government area of the state, where the troops came in contact with the irreditist group and, in the contact, neutralized one IPOP fighter while another was captured alive. The troops also recover one AK-47 rifle, one then gun, and police uniform, the army said. Reacting to the report, IPOB in a statement by its media and publicity secretary Mapoa for described the claim linking the camps to ESN as a blackmail and propaganda by the Nigerian army to tarnish the image of the secessionist group. IPOB said that in his detained leader, and the colonel's latest commandment. He said, let the Biafra land be peaceful. We are to protect our people, not to kill them. That protection is the reason we are here. Based on the instruction, powerful said that the people causing insecurity and criminalities are not within the canon and IPO, but agent provocators. The IPO spokesperson said, it is a common practice that many notorious contracted criminals and infiltrators are using Namde Kano's name in their nefarious activities. Some of those criminals are government covert masses who were paid to black men Namde Kano and a peaceful movement. We know them and we have used all means available to expose and the associates from them. Yet that wouldn't stop the government from leaking a to these criminals. IPO volunteers and ESM proprietors are not criminals in the canon I pop detest criminality. Every sustainable and uncompromised Biafra, including members of Eastern Vigilante groups, know that I pop members and ESN operatives are peaceful and not responsible for criminalities in the East. Those kidnapping for ransom and snatching cars are not I pop or ESN members. I pop volunteers and ESN operatives are very disciplined and loyal to the IPO leadership and hence can't misbehave on duty. The criminals arrested in those camps who were or would be paraded as IPO or ESN are either common criminals or the infiltrators who will be forced to claim that they are IPO or ESN members. We encourage Nigerian security agencies to continue fishing out those behind the insecurity ravaging the Southeast region. We are in support of every action that we guarantee the security of lives and properties of Biafrans. We demand a stop to desperate but fair effort to blackmail us by leaking IPOB and ESN operatives to the activities of criminals in East Powerful State. Now that I come to the end of the news, my analysis, what do you expect from Nigerian police and soldiers? They are the one com Collaborating with the infiltrators to cause insecurity in Ibo land with their president, Ibola Metinibu. So, what do you expect? They will always lie against the indigenous people.
even when you see the so-called spread infiltrator, they call themselves high pop. They call themselves high pop, or they call themselves power autopilot. This is what I am talking about. When you see criminals who want to destroy something, this is how they rule. They will have to attach their name with another different name. That way, when they do evil, that different name will be blamed for it. <laughs> Some of us don't understand this. Some of Biafran don't understand. They continue to fool themselves around. And some of them continue to play game. Some of them know what is happening. But they continue to play game because they love the game. And Nigerian government are enjoying the game because that is what they want. They want to bring Igbos down. I've said it several times. They want to destroy Igbos so that they will stop talking in Nigeria. First of all, they have denied you political engagement. Access to politics. That is why, since after the war, no Igbo man has been president of Nigeria. Now they want to destroy you physically, economically, because they can see that Igbos, no matter what you have done, they could not shine. These are government whom have tried everything possible to keep Igbos down all these years. And because they refuse to go down, they are doing everything possible to destroy their youth. Nigerian soldiers you see in Ibo land today, they are book around. They are book around, including the police. Just like Buhari said, if you repent as a book around, you can even be present on Nigeria tomorrow. This is the kind of country that people are living in. But I'm ashamed of our people that they allow themselves to be used whatever it is that they promised them to destroy their own life. That is the truth. These days what they do is to go and buy ammunition from Bukhara, machine guns. <laughs> buy from flying trucks. And these are people that Eastern Secretary are doing everything possible to clear away from Ibo land. What are people are going to them to buy machine gun to use to rise their people in Ibo land. Just like the kind one they use on a, a, a pocket. That is the truth. That is the truth. People think we are stupid. I've said it here, now I will not say it. This what is happening, we have to cut it from the root. If not, we are wasting our time. When you cut it from the root, those sponsoring them will no longer sponsor them. And for us to cut it from the root, you and I know what to do. And I've said this several times here, it's not a hard job to do. It's something that, even as I speak, people that can do it are everywhere. In the world. Friends. And they will do it. They will go through with it. If at the process something happens, believe me, they are on their own. They are aware of this. They will go in for it. And they do it in a way you would think it was too fighting that brought the problem. I've told you, all of us should stop wasting our time and allow our people to be killed in Ibo land because of some non-entities. I think I've come to the end of this new J. Yeah.